Live from Victory Park, this is News 8 Now. They might appear to be just another picture-perfect couple about to be married, but to the bride's dying father, they are his proof that she will be happy even after he's gone. Channel 8's Teresa Woodard shows us how their church is making sure he'll be there to walk her down the aisle and hear those two magical words, I do. They met here, so they must marry here. I'm living every girl's dream right now. <laughs> A young love that knows no bounds. Sadly, time does. To my baby girl. The father of bride Victoria McClure has waged a 12 year war on gastrointestinal cancer. Now the outlook isn't good. Well, I am definitely a daddy's girl, always have been. So um, it's been tough, you know. The proposal came Christmas Eve. They set a December 2014 date, but doctors said. They shouldn't wait. So they moved it up to Valentine's Day, and then the doctor advised us that we might want to even go a little sooner than that. And it was like our whole church stopped and just said yes. Somehow, the Mesquite First Assembly of God found a way to pull off a wedding in just weeks. One person said, I'll pay for her dress. One person said, I have all these chair covers that we can transform the gym in. Then the Dallas Bridal Show heard, and even bigger promises were made. Some drapery with lights behind it, some lighting effects on the wall. And Saturday, the gym will sparkle. The sanctuary will shine. Victoria will marry the man she loves. Yeah, we give all the glory to God for all everything that's happening. With the man who loved her first by her side. I'm just really happy that he's going to get to be there. And a daughter determined to take that walk with daddy. Just to be able to walk down the aisle and fulfill her dreams, you know, um, just when your child's happy, you're happy. A daddy determined. That's all that matters. To make his daughter's day. Teresa Woodard, Channel 8 News.